back to school could mean back pain for many students. For today's health alert, Karen Wynn is live at Asheville Middle School with more on backpack safety. So Karen, did your backpack pass the test? Actually, Darcell, it did. This is a backpack that my husband bought for our daughter. And the chiropractor we talked to really liked the big, thick straps with plenty of padding. Also, notice all the padding throughout the entire backpack. Now, my child's about to begin high school, but chiropractors say in middle school, especially middle schoolers and backpacks can be a painful combination. 14-year-old Michael Coleman is about to begin high school, but wearing a backpack the wrong way in middle school has taken its toll. It would like hurt around the shoulders where I carried my straps because I would try to lean forward holding my bag because it got heavy. Even after numerous chiropractic adjustments and changing oh, how he wow. carried his backpack, Michael's spine is still rotated. I would automatically put it over one shoulder like a habit and it was very hard to change. Michael's mother, Deborah, a chiropractic assistant, remains concerned. Not only for my child, but for other kids out there that are carrying these heavy backpacks and the weight gets to be a little too much. Chiropractor Dr. Sarah Lawson says about 20% of her patients are kids with pain and posture problems, and most of these kids are wearing their backpacks improperly. Children and teenagers specifically do not want to wear both straps on their backs. Dr. Lawson says that peer pressure combined with larger books and more homework can make middle schoolers more vulnerable to back problems. But Michael Coleman says he will not bow to that peer pressure in high school. I like my back the way it is now. One more thing that Dr. Lawson says, make sure that your backpack does not fall below your waist. Obviously, we have a bit of adjusting to do. Live in Asheville, I'm Karen Wynn, News 13.